Welcome back to the channel guys. In today's video we leave Vietnam and we go to Cambodia. We're gonna take a bus from Ho Chi Minh City all the way to the capital of Cambodia Phnom Penh. So we'll show you how we book the ticket but also the entry requirements for Cambodia and then we'll arrive in Phnom Penh, check in at the hotel, settle in and I will show you around. So sit back, relax and enjoy this video. for this taxi ride look how much money it is <laughs> fifty thousand <000. laughs> all right thank you thank you so yeah we're looking for a bus from uh, Ho Chi Minh City to Phnom Penh in Cambodia and see what they have to offer hello so we're gonna go from Ho Chi Minh to Phnom Penh. Okay. Price right now 35 US dollar. 35. Yeah. And uh, what's the company? D DK. D and D. DK. This is one of the bus Cambodia to Vietnam. D and D. So this is the sleeper bus. It is the regular bus. Yeah. So I think we're gonna get this one. So we're going to pay one million seven hundred thousand dong for two people. So I don't have money, so he will bring me to the ATM to withdraw cash. Perfect, thank you. Double. So we're gonna get the tickets now, but we're leaving in a couple of days. So, yeah. but better to book in advance. <laughs> this area is full of like tour agency that they will sell you tickets to basically everywhere. We booked through DND, &D, which is actually this shop. So this was the official uh, shop, but we booked through an agency there, but that's fine because I guess it's the same price. So we have to show up here at 6.45 a.m. in a couple of days and the bus will just arrive here. All right, guys, I'm not going to bore you with a step by step application in order to apply for the e visa for Cambodia. I actually made a video where I was guiding you step by step, but I don't know if I'm going to post it. But just to sum it up, most of the countries, they need to apply for the e visa, even if you go to Cambodia for one week two weeks or one month you need to apply for the e-visa just very few countries are exempt to apply for the e-visa one of them is thailand so probably she didn't need to apply for the e-visa but i had to apply it costs 36 us dollar and you need to upload your hotel booking in cambodia the health insurance for cambodia your vaccine certificate then you make the payment you wait a couple of days and then you should be able to receive the e-visa pretty easily at least that's what happened to me after 24 hours i got my e-visa and the application was extremely extremely easy i'll put the link down below for the e-visa application and also for the insurance for cambodia all right guys 6 30 in the morning we are leaving saigon and we are heading to cambodia The bus is here. All right, I have to be honest, this DD &D bus ride was not what I expected. It was totally a nightmare to be honest because the seat is supposed to be like a sleeper seat but it was so small that I cannot even fit my leg into it. So I had to stay the entire trip in a super uncomfortable position. It was so painful. And then I look around and everybody was struggling. So it doesn't matter if you are short or tall, everybody was struggling to put their legs because those seats were extremely, extremely small. Even plus she couldn't put her legs into it. So I don't know how they designed those things, but I'm not gonna take this bus anymore. All right, this is the Vietnamese immigration. Oh, here they're selling like a SIM card. Guys, 
he was not allowed to record inside the immigration he asked me to delete everything so now we got our passport back and we should do the Cambodia border we literally drive for like 50 meters 30 seconds and now we have to go down again to the Cambodia border it was easier just to walk Uh, this is the lunch break stop right after the border we just draw for like uh, 10 minutes and we already stop again guys we made it to Phnom Penh after eight hours we left at 7 15 and we arrived now at uh, 3 15 p.m. actually the hotel is just uh, 600 meters away so we're probably gonna walk there and uh, check in all right we made it this is the hotel Sim Boutique Hotel let's go and check in They give us a welcome drink and uh, the hotel is extremely busy for check-in. Alright, we got the room uh, 302. Uh, I like the design with wood, it's pretty small to be honest, even though it's a superior room. But look at the view, it's amazing. <laughs> Full sea view of the city. <laughs> Incredible view. <laughs> we pay 2300 baht for two nights, including breakfast. Despite the room, they should have a nice uh, rooftop swimming pool and rooftop sky bar, which should have uh, like a nice view of Phnom Penh and the entire city. So let's check it out. Sky bar and pool on the 15th floor. Beautiful, man. And then one floor up is the sky bar. Wow, what a view. Wow, man. That's a beautiful sky bar. I heard they have like a party here until late at night. It looks nice. Wow, it's a beautiful rooftop sky bar. What a view. <laughs> Try DJ in the house, put your hands up. Man, so many towers under construction. This one is under construction. All of those, this one. This place in a few years is gonna be full of skyscrapers. Even here. That one under construction, this one under constructions, that one under constructions. So we're gonna get a grab tuk tuk for 5,800 real. All right, this is our uh, grab tuk tuk. Hello. The tuk-tuk here, they look like the one in uh, Sri Lanka and India. They are the same model. Somehow it feels like a little bit of India. So many motorbikes shop around here. So we're going to Ion Shopping Mall, which it seems to be the biggest shopping mall here in Phnom Penh. Uh, we want to go to a shopping mall to get a, a Cambodian SIM card. 
and also to grab some food because we didn't eat since this morning and we just feel safer in a shopping mall as it's the first day we just arrived everything is a bit overwhelming so it's safer to be in a shopping mall get the sim card eat something and get used to Cambodia <laughs> We made it to the shopping mall. Thank you. Let's see what we got. We got roasted duck with the rice and also some tom tom sum. Tim sum. Some tim sum coming soon. So I just bought the SIM card at the Smart Shop, which is supposed to be the best internet provider and SIM provider here in uh, Cambodia. I pay, I pay $7 in total, so $2 for the SIM card and $5 for 40 giga for one month. But if I wanted less, I could also pay $2 for 16 giga. So I think it's a pretty good deal, like $7 total, 40 giga for one month. And I have my internet now. That's it for today's video guys. I hope you enjoyed this trip from Ho Chi Minh City in Vietnam all the way to Phnom Penh in Cambodia. Stay tuned because this is just the beginning. I'm gonna show you Phnom Penh properly and then we're gonna explore more of Cambodia. So I'm excited to share everything with you. Let me know in the comments below if you have ever been to Cambodia or maybe you're planning to come. For me, it's my very first time and I'm very excited to be here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.